Dave, thank you so much for giving us the opportunity to tour the beautiful parade home. But you've mentioned that you had a couple other models available in, in this community. They're, they're available for purchase right now? Absolutely. Do you mind giving us a yeah. tour? Yeah. So the garage door on this one is a little different, but you still have the beautiful combination of exterior tile, blacks and grays and whites with an outdoor deck as well. I'll let you take it from here. <laughs> okay, um, I think we did want to point out on all these uh, homes, we've got these iron doors. So very strong, very cool looking. This, this glass actually opens and there's a screen behind it. So you can still have your door dead bolted and get a breeze. We love those. Dave, thank you again for giving us a tour of this incredible unit. And it is available for sale right now, right? Correct. So what would somebody have to pay in order to make these views and this unit their own? So this house is a three bedroom, four bathroom, as we saw. The square footage is 2845. And we have this listed on the MLS right now for 1.3. So for 1.3 million, this can be yours. I will post a link to the full uh, MLS listing for this home so you can see for yourself in the description below this video. And if you guys would like to get a personal tour of this home, please feel free to reach out to me and we could get a schedule. We've got a front bedroom, could be used as an office again. With the guest bathroom right next to it. Beautiful under cabinet lighting in that one as well. We've been having a lot of fun with these. We've decided to do different styles in a lot of our stuff. That's what we seem to be hearing from, you know, the buyers out there. They, they like a mix of styles. So the first house we went through is a modern house. This one is more of a loft style. I love it. And so this one has, it has room to put in an elevator shaft if somebody wanted to as well, right? So we can, we added the electricity and everything is ran up in the ceiling above this pillar. The style for this house, we, we can get a glass tube where you can go up and kind of go with the whole loft house look that we would If you wanted to. Yeah, everything. I love all of the exposed HVAC plumbing, the brick on this wall, everything just flows together so perfectly. Yeah, thanks. It reminds me of modern penthouses like downtown Chicago. Brings back memories. Exactly what we're <laughs> But these views, you won't get these views anywhere else. <laughs> that, is, that is why we decided to build here. These views are amazing. We worked on getting this land for a well, long right? time. Yep. Hidden pantry, Bosch appliances in this one. <laughs> it's large. <laughs> and how many bedrooms does this one have? This one is a three bedroom, four bathroom. We've kind of dubbed this house as the entertaining house. So every bedroom has an ensuite, and then there's also a hallway bath. There's, uh, this one has the ensuite. The other two have the baths next to them. And then there's a separate bath by the great room upstairs for, you know, guests when you're having your entertaining. I absolutely love all the tile and color combinations in this one as well. I'll move out of the way so you can get in that closet. We went with all the closet organizers in these homes. Really nice USB outlets, and charger stuff in your closet. I, I love all the built-ins and closet organizers. I think it, it adds that extra plush touch to the closets because normally closets and pantries are kind of ugly. <laughs> right. You know, you just have your MDF shelves and Stuff doesn't look pretty, but with closet organizers, it really brings it to the next level. Should we go upstairs? As you come up the stairs, you'll notice we continued the overgrouted brick look that we had downstairs. 
Continued it up the stairwell and into our little kitchenette. It is so nice to have a kitchenette on an upper level because after you've navigated the stairs, you may have, and there's plenty of room to entertain up here as well. So you've got deck that's facing to the north, deck that's facing to the south, this entire area. So naturally you would want to have a kitchenette if you wanted to grab a beverage or a snack and be able to entertain both of your decks. That's what I like. <laughs> and there's separate climate zones too, right? Correct. Yep. Downstairs and upstairs are both zoned separately. Did the exposed pipe, exposed HVAC up, up here in the great room as well. Flows throughout. Some built-in speakers. Yeah, did the surround sound. All the, t all the rooms have TV outlets and ethernet ports. And we did where you can run them up the wall in case you have a TV you hang on the wall. It's ready to go. And I'm absolutely obsessed with these views. I would imagine just spending early mornings, afternoons out on this patio with a beautiful built-in fireplace. Just needs some patio furniture right here. And did you say this one, was this one rated for the hot tub? Correct. Yeah, this one's engineered to hold a hot tub. We've got the 220 right there, so it's ready to go. So your hot tub could go right here, right underneath the stars, unobstructed sky. Uh, you've got a golf course, a little bit of the desert, no light pollution, so you could watch the stars from your hot tub within the rear deck with the added privacy from being fenced in by your home and the golf course out back. And there's a lot of privacy between this and the next one. These are pretty thick, pretty thick walls to fit a fireplace on both sides. Oh, and your hose bib to fill up the hot tub. <laughs> That's perfect. <laughs> right. And then you have a whole other deck that opens up to the front and the future amenities are coming just to the side of the house. So you're just a short, short skip away from the pickleball courts, the pool, and all the amenities that are coming into this community. And we have two bedrooms on this level? Uh, this one bedroom and the two bathrooms. Oh, so this bedroom. bedroom's kind of got their bathroom and then the other bathroom is, if you're entertaining all those guests, you've got another bathroom. Nice walk-in closet. Again, those big windows. We have a really cool looking design on the outside of the house, like you're saying with the exterior tile. That was very well thought out by the builder. It's beautiful in literally every direction. Nice set of double doors to access your front patio. Have we seen everything here or missing That anything? is this one. Other than I think we did miss the bottom deck. There is a bottom patio as well off the main floor that's pretty large as well. That's cool. it.
have one more, one more unit, right? There's actually we another have, one. We have two, <laughs> two more to more. walk through, but uh, this is, and all of them are so unique, but uh, this particular model uh, is you know, wildly different from the other two, but Dave's gonna tell us all about it. 